When I hit the ball, it often veers left and lands in the trees. But I know how to correct my swing. I understand my game. And I live my life the same way. I guess, you know, it was Walter Hagen who once said, you can hit three bad shots and one good shot and still make par. And uh, I think that's um, a little bit kind of how my life goes, you know. Uh, it doesn't have to be perfect. Um, you just, um, you just got to fight hard and find a way to get it done. Being bald doesn't really bother me. I kind of like it. I'm blessed to have a decent shaped head, so I kind of have the look for it. There's really uh, been no correlation to the uh, girls liking me better with hair or without hair. You have the same type of haircut. Whenever James would come for his appointments, he sits in the lobby and looks around for uh, someone to talk to, someone that looks like him. He and his mom also really like to help other families out if they meet someone in the lobby that maybe needs help, whether it's finding a place to stay or anonymously sending them things they needed. incredibly lucky to have James and his entire family in my life. For James's 16th birthday party, instead of having a huge bash, he had a toga party. He charged admission, and the uh, proceeds from the toga party went to cancer research. And I think that's when I first realized how serious James was into changing the outcome of patients with osteosarcoma. Really, how many 16-year-olds don't have a huge bash, but have a party and dedicate the proceeds to research? Keep in, in mind, particular, and that's 47. That's the number of kids who are diagnosed with cancer in America each day. And as long as that number is still there, we will be here to do our part. And thank you so much for your work.